welcome back to another video everyone, it's Anthony TDJ or Anthony the Dubstep Gamer. So yeah, I'm going to warn that this video is going to be a little bit more rambly and more personal than my normal videos. I usually make guides and stuff like that, but as you may know, I got a copyright strike from Hoyaverse, so I'm going to dive into that. And another thing, I'm going to dive into the future of my channel because with these strikes, and I don't know how well the situation is going to go, but if it goes poorly, I might have to change up my strategy for how I'm going to do things with my channel moving forward. But to start off, I did get a copyright strike from Hoyaverse for the two videos that I had in my channel that were the most popular videos on my channel, which included the Farina and Charlotte Kit explanation videos. Now, I didn't use any images, leaks, or even video or audio or any, like, physical evidence of the leaks. I just talked about it in speculation, discussion, even just, over yeah, just overall discussion, actually. Now, I could be wrong, and I probably overstepped the bounds of fair use, but I don't think I did. So I submitted counters, and one of them got rejected already, but I resubmitted it, and I'm overall just trying to see how this goes, because I cannot have the most popular videos being taken down on my channel, especially since they got me so much subscribers, comments, likes, and all kinds of discussion. And I really enjoyed discussing with you guys about certain Genshin content and stuff like that. But the other part of this video, I was going to go over the future of my channel. Now, let's say the strikes are not going away, and I'm completely in the wrong. I would have to make different videos moving forward. I would either have to not go over Genshin leaks at all to be safe because I don't want my channel deleted. Now, if the strikes really did go away and stuff like that, I would go back to making Genshin guides on like upcoming characters and stuff like that. But I'd just be a little bit more careful. I'd probably use a little bit of uh, different terminology, or I probably won't discuss it as often. The main reason is because I am a general gaming channel. Like, I post funny moments, I post let's plays and stuff from different games, so I'm overall like a general channel. I know that I'm known mainly for Genshin stuff, and that's fine. It's my favorite game, and I play it like very often, and I'm fine with, you know, like theory crafting and discussing things because I'm very passionate for the game and I'm heavily invested into it. But I'm gonna keep making general videos along with all of that, and what I'm gonna do to make it more organized and less crowded is all the funny moments, instead of making like a huge compilation and stuff I might just move all of them into like daily YouTube shorts or something like that because that gets more engagement on that side of the YouTube and for any stuff that I was gonna plan like any voiceover side of things like all the voice acting and voice impression stuff I think I might make a second channel where I do just straight up skits and all other kinds of voiceover demos but yeah I just wanted to make this video to update you guys on the situation that's going on right now because I know some of you may be very confused and I'm sorry about that but yeah, I really hope this situation gets resolved pretty soon. If there's anything I got wrong or am I missing or something that you want to discuss, feel free to discuss it in the comments with me. But that's going to be all for this video. If you guys like this video, please leave a like and subscribe as I very much so appreciate it. Stay tuned for updates about this situation and other kinds of videos of mine. But as always, take care and have a great day.